Welcome to Mountain Health Today. I'm Ted Owens, your host, and this is a program that is brought to you by the Tahoe Forest Health System. My guest today, as always, is Harry Weiss, President and CEO of the Tahoe Forest Health System. Harry, so good to see you. Thank you for joining us. It's great to spend a few moments with you and share some important uh, news for our community. Well, let's get right to it, Harry. Today we're going to talk about patient resources that are available at the Tahoe Forest Health System. And just to name a few, that would include customer care navigators, financial customer service, my chart, and of course, tfhd.com, among others. Uh, before I do that, how common is it for a rural hospital to have these types of resources available to its constituency? I would think if you did a deep, careful review of the critical access hospitals across uh, the U.S., you would find it extremely rare to have a financial customer service team, to have uh, patient customer care navigators, uh, et cetera. It's, it's extremely rare, and we're grateful to have that for our team here. Very, um, very often in healthcare, we use a lot of terminology that we are very uh, familiar with, but often our patients are not, or folks at home are not. So let's start with customer care navigators. What is a customer care navigator? As, as many people have figured out, navigating through uh, healthcare for a particular injury or illness is very, very complicated. And uh, our navigators, our navigators really own and are an advocate for uh, our patients uh, to really help them make sure that they're getting the right type of physician visit on time, the right kind of lab or x-ray testing or other treatments or a surgery if necessary, and potentially even outside of the health system if necessary. And that's what our very dedicated and trained uh, team of customer care navigators does. And, and just so that I understand here, um, I could call a customer care navigator uh, because I have an ailment and I don't know where to begin. Let's say I don't have a, a primary care physician. Is that a good place to start? I think if uh, you just need a to see a, a primary care physician, you don't really have any health issues, uh, you could uh, call them, uh, but it's really there to help somebody who has a complex illness that or injury that's likely going to require that you see several different providers or a provider many times, or it's gonna require several visits to a hospital or hospitals or maybe procedures. So we do have a, a great number for somebody who just wants to see a physician, and that's our 582-6205 uh, access center number. And that's where we would call if you're just simply wanting to connect with a physician. But if you've got this challenge of, you know, this is complex and I've got to have help, that's what our customer care navigators are for. Harry, can a navigator assist somebody who of their own initiative might want to seek out uh, wellness programs or things of that nature. Can they do that with the assistance of a, of a care navigator? Yes, yeah, so they can pursue therapeutic improvements of uh, traditional illness or injury issues, but they can also connect to our large array of health and wellness resources, and our navigators are, help, are very happy to do that. And um, what are the hours? When, when can you call a, a care navigator? Yes, we have our customer care navigators are available Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. And they can be reached at 530-587-3769. And do they, uh, Harry, if you establish a, a phone call a conversation with a healthcare navigator, if you need to call back, do you go to the same navigator, or can they, or or, or can their request be seen by a different uh, recipient of their call? Uh, you can request a change, but uh, typically we will try to have the same navigator assist you through your continuum of care for a better outcome. Okay, we've been talking with Harry Weiss, President and CEO of the Tahoe Forest Health System 
Uh, this is Mountain Health Today, and we're talking about customer care navigators. Um, Monday through Friday, 8 to 6.30, there's a phone number here, Harry, for assistance, 530-587-3769. How, how old is this program at the Tahoe Forest Health System? Is this something relatively new? It started in roughly the last uh, two and a half years, if I recall. And a great benefit to a rural environment, Tahoe Forest Health System, your region, uh, share with the folks at home who's in our region and who can access a healthcare navigator. Uh, basically, any of our residents within uh, the service area that we provide are, are welcome uh, to call us and to pursue this great uh, service. And again, it's available for services within our health system and will also assist in connecting you to another health system if needed. Okay, so that would be a Greater North Lake Tahoe area, Incl Incline Village Community Hospital as well. Is that part of the healthcare navigator system? Yes, yes, that is absolutely correct. What about folks from uh, out of the immediate area but might be seeking care like from say Sierra County or up north? Can they access this as well? Right, uh, patients in Sierra or uh, those counties uh, uh, can also assist and, and access our services as well. Okay, thank you. We've been talking about patient resources available at the Tall Forest Health System, customer care navigators. We're going to shift gears in a moment, uh, but we're going to step away uh, to the folks at home. Thank you for tuning in, and we will be right back. Welcome back to Mountain Health Today. I'm Ted Owens, your host, and we're talking with Harry Weiss, President and CEO of the Tahoe Forest Health System. And today we're talking about patient resources that are available at the Tahoe Forest Health System. Uh, we were talking about custom care, customer care navigators. But Harry, let's switch gears and talk about another uh, service, the Financial Customer Service uh, Department. What, what do they do? What, what's the benefit of having that uh, service available to the public? Sure, and again, this is also a very rare service in uh, critical access hospitals across America, but we're really happy to have that as we, we want to be able to try to proactively answer questions and partner with our community uh, when they have questions or concerns about healthcare. But what this financial customer service team does is they're really here. They've been very specially trained and uh, they're here to, for example, really help answer questions about your healthcare bill. And because we're a diverse healthcare system with many clinics and other care sites and different communities, and so they can answer questions about any of those settings outside of the hospital or at the hospital to explain your bill. And, uh, you know, does it include physician component or not? And and so forth so that your specific questions are answered. It can also uh, help you in setting up uh, and receiving a payment for your healthcare services or setting up a payment plan uh, should the amount be a little bit higher than you might be able to handle at this moment. And they're also able as they hear your comments and so forth uh, to perform a review and they could make uh, corrections to a bill should there be an error on that bill uh, as well. Uh, they can let's also- go, Harry, research. Harry, let's go back to the bill because healthcare bill billing is confusing to a lot of people. Er, folks have different insurance. Not everybody is the same, right? So what you're telling me is that financial customer service uh, folks on the other end of the phone can walk me right through my bill, explain my insurance, uh, if need be, to me, is that what they do? They really get that granular and in, 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 in helping people? 
That's exactly right. And, you know, no, no two insurance policies are, are all, you know, rarely the, the same. And so they can help you understand your specific insurance. And even if necessary, uh, do a three-way call with your insurance company to help you understand the nuances of that policy. That's a, that's a benefit in and of itself. Uh, because m m many of us don't even know what to ask an insurance company if we're fortunate enough to get through and, on, and calling them direct. So they stay on the line with the patient and contact the insurance company, and it's a three-way conversation. That's what I understood. Yeah. Wow. That's correct. Um, let's, uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, estimates. Can they provide estimates for, for a patient prior to, uh, to a procedure? With especially with the advent of many large uh, or high deductible health plans that started probably about five or six years ago, uh, our, our team has really made a deep commitment and has developed some tools. And again, these are estimates because healthcare is much more complex than getting a repair done on your automobile, and, et cetera. But we do have uh, good processes to give you an estimate in advance of what this procedure might cost, what your insurance, if any, would cover, uh, what we, what your out-of-pocket expenses would be, and do that on the physician component as well as the hospital component. So that is something we really strive to do in advance of your care, you know, should you want to know that. And uh, Harry, you mentioned um, they help screen for financial assistance because sometimes people do find themselves in a very difficult situation. And isn't it true that uh, oftentimes a patient may not even be aware that there's a financial assistance program and that they may qualify for some assistance? That's absolutely correct. And sometimes a patient might be a little bit shy or afraid to say, you know, I'm really having a severe hardship going on in our household at this time. And we ask that the, our families really be open with us uh, about uh, uh, what's going well or not going well financially, because we have a wide variety of financial assistance uh, programs that are meant to be relevant to our patients in our community. And in many cases, our patients are surprised how that it really solved a huge burden for them that the patient just didn't know how they were going to overcome it. And Harry, we're going to talk a little bit later about your electronic health record system, MyChart. But uh, can MyChart, if you haven't uh, engaged in it yet for your health records, can they help me do that? If I call Yes, uh, they can absolutely walk you through the steps. If you are a patient here at Tall Forest Health System and setting up your own MyChart account, and you can connect with financial customer service and many other types of team members there. And Harry, we have about a minute left. A, also, another service I understand that's provided uh, through financial customer service is uh, the ability to help you. For example, if you need to uh, uh, go for specialized care outside of the health system, they'll help you get your records released to where you're going. Is that, is that accurate? Yes, uh, our financial customer service team can help with that, or our patient care navigators can help make sure that uh, the receiving health system is getting all of the clinical information that you need. And one of the tools that really helps us is that many of these great facilities are on Epic. And uh, my chart and Epic uh, really helps lessen that burden they, for you. They talk to each other. Yes. Okay, we're going to come back in just a minute. We're talking about patient resources available at the Tahoe Forest Health System. We'll be back in just a moment.
Welcome back to Mountain Health Today. I'm Ted Owens, and today we're speaking with Harry Weiss, President and CEO of the Tahoe Forest Health System. And we're talking about uh, resources, patient resources that are available at the Tahoe Forest Health System. Harry, a moment ago, we were talking about the financial customer service uh, program. Uh, how would one access that? What are the hours of operation? Where, do, where does someone go? Yes, uh, our hours of service for the financial customer service team is Monday to Friday, 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. And walk-ins are welcome. Uh, the two locations are at uh, 10875 Pioneer Trail. This is in the Pioneer Commerce Center or at uh, Inside Tall Forest Hospital, which is located at 10121 uh, Pine Avenue. Thank you very much, Harry. And in our last, uh conversation, we talked a little about electronic health record systems, MyChart, which is what we call it at Tahoe Forest. What is MyChart? MyChart is an important, uh, say, web portal for our patients, which is an important improvement journey <laughs> in allowing our patients to really have greater access uh, to their health medical record, to have new and additional ways 24-7 uh, uh, to really reach out uh, to the provider team, to the financial customer service team, and you can send a message, ask a question, uh, just a whole variety of things uh, we can cover. Um, how does one get uh, set up on my chart? How do they get their own account? What I would recommend is that you please call our financial customer service team again at uh, 530-582. 3298 and have them while on the phone walk you through getting your uh, web portal set up so that you can enjoy a long list of functions. Can uh, can somebody receive that type of assistance at an in-office visit with a provider? Yes, uh, any one of our office staff when you're at the doctor's office, uh, they can help you set it up. Uh, that's how it was done for me as well. We also have a website, tfhd.com forward slash my chart to also uh, learn more. But uh, our, our staff and our physician offices or financial counselor, uh, customer service individuals are really happy to help you. And it's amazing in that you can message your providers. You can ask medical questions. You can look at test results of of lab tests or x-rays. You can request a medication refill. Uh, you can uh, schedule appointments or begin that process to do that. You can even pay your bill and much more. Harry, uh, you had mentioned earlier the Epic platform. Now, one thing that's, there are several providers of electronic health records across the United States. Um, they're not all the same. They don't all have the same functionality. What's the benefit of being on Epic? The, the great benefit for patients in our wide region or many visitors that come to us, if you look at the most top of mind and most admired health systems across America, Epic is probably viewed as the number one electronic health record used by uh, health systems across America. And a key portion of that epic is my chart, which is empowering our patients uh, to connect with their medical record, to connect with their care team. And so as you travel, you have, for example, you're in Truckee and you end up in the Bay Area or you end up in Roseville or you end up in Reno, uh, and many of the facilities are on epic. And so they can see the care that you received to date you avoid uh, guessing, you avoid redundant testing. Avoiding redundant testing can save healthcare costs and get to your uh, next phase of recovery quicker. So Epic is such a valuable uh, tool with its care uh, anywhere process. Now, Harry, if you have uh, a, um, a, a situation where you, re you, you require very specialized healthcare somewhere else, uh, maybe it's in California, maybe it isn't. Uh, being on Epic and through MyChart has a great value 
in providing your health record and images and what have you to that other specialty team, correct? That is absolutely correct. So whether you needed to go to any of the top 10 hospitals in the nation, uh, generally they are on Epic and they can see immediately what you had done. And if you're traveling to us and you've been to good uh, or great healthcare centers out there, we can see the care that you've had as well so that we can have better continuity for you, whether it's to us or to them. And this really uh, improves and protects your health status. Harry, today we've talked about uh, many of the resources available at the Tahoe Forest Health System to patients. Um, where can folks uh, go to uh, start exploring and learn more? Yes, a couple of areas. Go to tfhd.com forward slash my chart to really learn how to do this. Or again, please call our financial customer service team 530-582-3298. Thank you very much. Um, We've been uh, talking today about a variety of resources that are available to patients at the Tahoe Forest Health System. Our guest has been Mr. Harry Weiss, who is president and CEO of the Tahoe Forest Health System. Thank you very much for joining us today, Harry. I'm Ted Owens, your host, and this is Mountain Health Today. And thank you very much for watching. Harry, we have about 30 seconds. Do you have anything to say about COVID-19? Just very briefly, um... You know, please don't call our emergency department. Uh, you know, should you have questions about uh, just testing, just uh, contact 530-582-3450 Monday through Friday for your COVID questions. Thank you very much, Harry. To the folks at home, thank you very much for tuning in. We really appreciate it. Bye now.